With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello guys, our today's question is for the reaction 2a plus b forming product when the concentration of a and b both were doubled the rate of reaction increased from 0.3 mole per liter per second to 2.4 mole liter per liter per second when the concentration of a alone is doubled the rate increased from 0.3 mole per liter per second to 0.6 mole per liter per second and we have to find what is the overall order of this reaction before starting this question solution we have to know the some basic concepts related to rate of equation suppose if we are talking about a reaction a plus b forming a product p according to rate law expression according to rate law what rate law said that for this particular reaction rate of a reaction that is directly proportional to the concentration of a to the power x and how x we find x will be find according to the particular experiment again the rate of reaction is also depend upon the concentration of b to the power y this y and this x they both are find according to experimental and practical values let this equation be 1 and let this equation be Adding this equation 1 and 2 by joint variation theorem, we get that is R is directly proportional to the product of concentration of A to the power X and B to the power Y. Removing this variation sign, we got R is equals to K times the concentration of A to the power X and concentration of B to the power Y. This is our rate law expression this is called rate of the reaction this is our equilibrium constant and this is the concentration of a and b and this is x and y with the help of x and y we calculate order of a reaction we should mind one thing that when the concentration of a and b will change then the value of k doesn't change because this is independent of concentration of A and B. The value of rate of the reaction will vary according to this concentration. Mind that this is constant value. This is constant for every reaction. The value changes only of rate reaction. Okay. The question is given that the value of rate of reaction is 0 0.3 when the concentration of A is A and B b is b okay when the value of concentration our first case is when the value of rate of reaction changes to 2.4 the concentration of a is doubled as well as concentration of b is doubled let this equation be third again our second case is when the value of r changes to 0 0.6 and this is k times the double concentration of a that is the scenario when the concentration of a changes only not b b remains same let this equation as equation number four and also this equation as equation number five from this equation we can calculate the value of x as well as y from equation three and four from equation three and four what we get we are dividing this equation that is 2.4 divided by 0 0.6 it's equals to we know this k will cancel and this equals to 2a to the power x and 2b to the power y here 2a to the power x 
and b to the power y and this will cut in four times this 2a to the power x will cancel this and this b to the power y will cancel this b to the power y what will remain here will remain 4 and here 2 to the power y so from here we can calculate that the value of y is equals to from equation 4 and 5 0 0.6 divided by 0 0.3 here k will cancel 2a to the power x and b to the power y and here a to the power x and b to the power y from here we can find cancel these two times and cancelling this p to the power y as well as a to the power x from here we will get 2 to the power x it can be easily seen that the value of x is equals to 1 the order of the reaction is order of a reaction is equals to the sum of x and y the value of x is 1 and the value of y is 2 so the order of the reaction will be 3 so it is a third order reaction thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today